see if you look what we got kicking here. Right through the shield, which if you can hear that, I just shot it about 20 yards right through right to there. What's up everyone? Coop here with Hunting Carolinas and FX Outdoors. Uh, the video and the pictures you just saw were from a hunt I did with the FX Crown Airbow a um, couple months ago. Um, I wanted to go out, test that uh, Airbow out uh, on, a, on a huge hog. Um, I had that boar lingering around for a couple weeks uh, chasing some sows and uh, I wanted to try to get after them. So honestly, the boar got to slip on me. I uh, just got in the blind, just sat down, didn't even get anything set up, and he was out there right at 20 yards. So I had a, a 300 grain uh, steel force broadhead on the air bow um, shooting. I, I chronoed the air bow at 400 feet per second with a 100 grain broadhead. Um, definitely shooting significantly slower, so I set the blind up at about 20 yards. Um, he came out, shot him just behind the shoulder, right through the heart. He ran off in the woods probably 20, 30 yards. Uh, quick, easy recovery. Uh, however, I didn't get to capture it on camera, which was my main goal, um, to see how well this thing would perform on a big, mature hog. Um, thing had cutters like that. Uh, it was a gorgeous stud of a hog. So I uh, brought it back to the skin area, got some pictures, and then went set back up at about 20 yards and shot it. As you see uh, with that second shot, uh, he was already stiffened up pretty good, and that arrow still got the same penetration as the previous arrow did from the kill shot uh, right behind the shoulder. Uh, that hog, you could see by me knocking the shield, just how thick the shield was on that hog. Um, it was not thick per se like that, but it was just, it was like leather. Um, that 300 grain broadhead punched right through that hog out the other side. Um, so definitely a super freaking uh, great piece of gear, the FX Crown Airbow. Um, definitely going to be making a huge impact in the uh, community, uh, especially for, you know, disabled veterans, disabled folks. I mean, anybody who loves to fling projectiles and hunt with something new, um, this thing is a pretty good piece of gear. Uh, I know a lot, of st a lot of states are now starting to authorize uh, hunting with airbow uh, in some of their primitive seasons. Um, you know, check your state and local laws, obviously, uh, before you go, at, go afield with one of these for big game. Um, but I know here in North Carolina, it's authorized. Um, I'm looking forward to hunt some deer with this thing uh, this fall. Worked on that freaking big hog. Um, I'm just super impressed. I'm pleased. Um, it's got a wonderful wood grain GRS stock on it. Uh, if you're not familiar with GRS stocks, um, I definitely recommend get, uh, checking them out. Uh, they are phenomenal stocks, great price. Uh, it was topped with an element scope. Uh, I've been nothing but impressed with element scopes. Um, they are uh, phenomenal as well. Uh, FX Crown Airbow uh, element scope, GRS stock, um, just a great uh, piece of gear to take a field. Uh, they've been taking a beating. Uh, that air bow, I've harvested two turkeys and a and that hog with it. I'm looking forward to deer season with this thing. Um, that's all I got for you guys today. Thanks for watching.